Hey you guys, welcome back to 12 Days of Fitness. My name is Sarah. Today we are gonna hit upper body for about four minutes and then we're gonna continue with your ladder. So we're on day 11. Tomorrow is your final day where we'll put that whole ladder together for 10 minutes. But again, you know this, our goal for these 10 minute workouts are to keep consistent and keep you guys moving through the holidays. So with that being said, we're gonna go ahead and get started. I am gonna use a set of medium weights so I have a set of 10 pound with me and that'll get us through our first two moves and then the entire ladder is done with just our body weight. So again, if you guys don't have weights at home or equipment, I'm gonna offer you guys two moves that you can do with just your body weight. We're gonna be focusing on the upper body. We're gonna be focusing on the Tabata round where you're doing bicep curls. So if you don't have equipment at home, you can either use just your arms, they weigh something, we're working against gravity, or you guys can drop down to a push-up. If you guys, um, again, don't have equipment, that's your option. You're either doing a push-up or you're with us in the bicep curl. The second move is gonna be an overhead press. So we're gonna be here. And then if you don't have your weights at home, you guys can do a tricep push-up. Now remember, those push-ups can happen on your knees or up on all fours, it's totally up to you guys. So I just wanna make sure we're offering things, right? Even if you don't have equipment, you guys can still do this entire workout. So we're gonna get a 10 second count in, we're gonna do 20 seconds of work, 10 seconds in between, four rounds, and then we're gonna pick up with your Christmas ladder. All right, hopefully you guys are enjoying. We are gonna get right into it. If you feel like you need to pause the video and warm up, go ahead and do so. But if you are ready, go ahead and grab those weights. And you've got a 10 second count in. We're gonna do a bicep curl, then we're gonna go into that overhead press. Here we go, you guys, in four seconds, in three, two, and one, we're going for 20 seconds here. Elbows are tucked in, weights in those heels. I have a slight bend in those knees. I'm coming all the way up with that bicep curl and extending all the way down. Nice work, you guys. Again, focusing for about four minutes on the upper body, and then we are gonna jump in to that ladder, beautiful, and rest. We are gonna flip those weights to our shoulders. We're gonna go up above our head for this next round. If you guys feel like you need to kickstand that back leg, that works as well. Here we go, you guys, 20 seconds in that overhead press. Remember, if you guys don't have weights at home, you guys can drop down to a tricep push-up for this. Nice work, you guys, really focusing on tucking that tailbone, driving those weights up to that ceiling. Two and one, gently letting them down. Nice work, again. You guys can kickstand that back leg to give you guys a little bit more stability. Going back to those bicep curls, you guys, we're getting right into it. Here we go. 20 seconds. Rockstar status. Relax those shoulders, you guys. Yes. Breathe. Slow and control with that pace. Remember, the goal of these are just to keep that body moving and give yourself a quick movement break during this busy time. Beautiful. Drop it down. All right, you guys know where we're going, up over that head. You guys can kickstand, getting those weights up, 90 degrees. Here we go, push it up, over that head, 20 seconds. Pull those shoulder blades down. Tuck that tailbone, so if I turn, you guys, you'll notice I'm not here, I've got that tailbone tucked, I'm pushing up, I'm pulling down. Nice work, you guys, four seconds. Three, two, and one. Bring it down. Guess what? You're already going into that third round here, all right? Back to those bicep curls in about three seconds. Two and one. Let's go. And the best part, you guys, if you want to turn this into a 30-minute workout or even a 20-minute workout, do it twice. So get the feel for it in the video. When you're done, do it again, all right? So if you're looking for a little bit more, that's totally an option. Or Combine two videos. We've got 12 of these for you guys. Beautiful. We're going back over that head. Same exact thing. Let's go ahead and get those weights up. Two and one. 20 seconds. Nice work, you guys. Breathe. At this point, you guys are probably noticing your heart rate's going up. That's partially because we're moving quickly. Also, we're bringing those arms above that head. Here we go. Three seconds. Two and one, love it. Guess what, you've gotta do each one one more time and then you're already done with that Tabata. All right, here we go guys, three, two, one, bicep curls, pull it up, come on. 
Yes, smile through. You can do this. 10 more seconds. Breathe. Woo. Four more seconds. Three, two, and one. Release. Last time going up and over that head and then we're gonna jump right into our pattern. <coughs> All right, here we go. Take it up. Woo. 20 seconds. Don't let it drop below those shoulders, you guys. Keep it at those 90 degrees. Come on, come on. Up. Woo. 10 seconds. Feel those shoulders. Tuck that tailbone, you guys. Don't use that lower back. Come on. Two. Last one. Push it up. And pull it down. Beautiful job, you guys. All right. We are done with the weights. We are going into that ladder. So what it looks like from here... We are going to start with our jumping jacks are our new move today. You guys have 11 of them. So either tapping side to side or you're all the way up, making sure you meet those hands. If you guys want a little bit more of a challenge, you guys can get down to that squat position and stay low here. Okay, so if you want a little bit more of a leg burner, that's an awesome option. So you've got 11 jumping jacks. We're gonna go down to the floor. 10 flutter kicks, we'll turn around, do nine of those shoulder taps. You've got eight chair squats, seven push-ups, six lunges, what's our five? Five tuck jumps, four squat hops, three tricep push-ups, two in outs, and one burpee at the end, all right? That's the ladder we're looking at. I'm gonna take about 10 seconds in between to reset, but I wanna get you guys out of here in a quickly manner. So here we go, we're gonna start with 11 jumping jacks, whatever works for you, in three, two, one, let's go, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. Beautiful job, you guys. Down to the floor. Flutter kicks. Take a breather. Exhale. Yes, here we go. Down to our back. Our shoulder blades are going to be up on that ground. Our arms are next to us. We can keep those knees bent. For a modified version, or we're coming all the way up and our legs are straight. In three, two, one, for 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. Beautiful job, you guys. Flip it over. We're in that shoulder tap. Now, you guys heard me saying that yesterday, but the day before, we want to make sure we're not turning those hips. So we're gonna get in that clean position, either on our knees or up on all fours, whatever works for you. Go ahead, come on up. Remember, that's wider we bring our legs, the more stance we're gonna have. Here we go, in three, two, one. Right, left, there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and nine. Nice work, bring it down. All right, going back up to the top. What do we have for eight? I always forget, chair squats. You guys can always add weights to this. It's totally up to you, so if you want to hold a weight at your chest, that's totally fine. Legs are gonna come together. We're squeezing everything, arms are gonna come up. In three, two, one, here it is. For eight, seven, six, five, four more. Three, two, and last one. Nice job. What do we have for seven? Seven push-ups. On your knees or up on all fours. Chest is gonna come all the way down to that ground. Neutral spine, meaning we're not looking at the camera. We're finding something that keeps everything in line. And three, two, one. Drop it down for seven, six, five, four, three, Two, last one, beautiful. Stand on up, five. No, I'm on six, I think it's lunge jumps, yes. You guys, we can either step these back, like so, 90 degrees, with that front foot, or we're adding a hop, it's totally up to you. Right, left, that's one, you've got six. And three, two, and one, here we go. Six, five, four, Three, two, last one, right, left. Nice job, you guys, take a breather. 
that heart rate's probably coming up. This next move, you guys, you have five tuck jumps. I'm gonna give you some options. You guys have seen it before. So, looks like this. We can tap, pull that knee up to the chest, alternating side to side. We can do our jumping jack. This is dangerous. We can do our jumping jack and jump straight up. You guys have a mat to the floor. We can be here, jump straight up, or we're jumping up all the way. Knees are coming to the chest. So we're here, landing nice and soft. All right, we've got five of those, and then we'll go into our squat hops and finish off strong. Here we go, you guys. Three, two, one. Let's go. Five, reset. Four, reset. Three, you know it, come on. Two, last one. Beautiful job, you guys. Woo, again, making sure you're light on those toes. Here we go. Four squat hops again. You guys can add weight to these. We're gonna squat down. Either stand up on our toes or squat down, jump up. Your choice. Four, three, two. Set it back. Four, three, two, one. Nice work. Grab that mat. You've got tricep push ups. Arms are together. Woo! I don't know about you guys, but I'm breathing heavy now. Arms are gonna be close together. Chest is right above those shoulders. We're here. And three, two, everything's tucked in. And one, drop it down for three. For two, and for one. Nice work. And out. Either hopping or walking. Your choice. I'm gonna back up so I don't kick my mat. So we're here in that plank. You can walk right foot, left foot, back, back, or we're hopping in and out. You've got two of those. Let's do it in three, two, one. Hop it in, hop out, hop it in, hop out. Slow and controlled. You guys should really feel it in that core. You guys know what's last. You have one burpee. So we go up, we jump back, or we can walk back. We do one big push up, we come up, hop up to the top, you're done. Here we are, you guys, in three, in two, in one, here it is, jump up, hop back, take it down, push up, up, yes. Nice work, you guys. Again, my name is Sarah, this is 12 days of fitness, day 11. Thank you guys so much for joining us. Andrea is gonna round up our challenge tomorrow with our entire ladder. She's also gonna be teaching her class at eight, so make sure you tune in. I will be live Christmas Day at our normal time on Saturdays for another great workout with you guys. All right, bye everyone.